Hi guys and welcome back to another video with Animal Central. Now today it's been a while, I know I need to get around to doing BLTW version 2.8, I know there were people sat at the um, computer desks, phones, iPads, whatever you watch my fabulous voice on, listen or watch, but yeah. Um, but yeah, you were thinking you should, you should be doing version 2.8 now. Well, what we're going to do is we're going to give that a little rest, just purely because this has um, come out again. And I've spent quite a few of my days um, driving this route, and I thought you guys might want to see it too. So basically, um, Heading Farp has reopened again. Um, we've got version 3, I think we're on now, um, that has a variety of routes and a nice bus station and things. Um, so today we're going to drive Route 51 using one of the X Hull, I think, or oh, these are X Manchester's the brand them, but they, they have them as Hull now, or oh, they have a few at Hull, not that many anymore. Um, 18026, so we're going to drive this on the 51 to Harrogate via Hewitt today, that is my diagram. So if you ever come on this um, map, there'll be a link in the description below. If you ever come on this, I am usually on the 51, unless there's specials going on, in which case I'll be doing those. And next week, I'll be doing the X51s as well. So, summer specials. And I'll be doing those all summer. So, without anybody on the server, we might as well depart now. I didn't give that enough room around, did I? Those wheels are turning like there's no tomorrow. So the two operators on this map at the moment are Stagecoach and um, Transdev, although it's currently just Stagecoach, uh, while well, Transdev establishes. I got through those lights. Yeah, it will be a bit laggy because I'm recording, but it's not too bad, that's quite good. So, yeah. The route has changed a bit since I last did it, so hopefully I have gone the right way. I think I did. Find out, we'll find out if I've gone the right way or not. Why has it told me that people have joined? That's weird. It doesn't do that usually, it doesn't usually tell people if you joined or not. Oh, if I just if I like ignore traffic lights, it's not because I'm trying to be rebellious, right? It's just because I don't use traffic lights. Nor do I go into the hospital if I know there's not enough people to actually be at the hospital or don't go to the hospital. If there's passengers in, then I'll pop in. But apart from that, I won't because all it does is it lags me out. So that's the hospital down there you're supposed to go into. And at Dennis Dart. I'm a lead PCV driver, so that basically means I'm a special PCV driver. I'm a special driver. <laughs> that's basically what that means. So this is quite a nice run, um, if I'm totally honest. It goes through Hewith that's basically inspired by Cleefort's Pier um, bus station. And then it goes up to Harrogate. There's quite a realistic, detailed version of Harrogate town centre. Especially to say it's in Roblox, it is very, very realistic. So there is bits like this with don't have scenery, but it's it simulates country roads. You can only do so much with a game like this. Yeah. As you can probably tell my voice might sound a bit different just because of my throat or my glands or whatever you call them. Um uh, like in agony as I speak, but we're gonna carry on anyway because and I'm more central, we do not give up. Unless I've really had enough, in which case we will. So yeah, um, it's the end of the school year um, in a few days' time. Yeah, it's been it's been like year-wise for the channel now. You you look back 
at the end of last year and things have changed like some stuff has stayed the same but some stuff has changed man so i can still use the same computer oh i'll leave that be um like some stuff has changed some stuff hasn't oh french gate's going to be closed Ooh. um but yeah i've had a lot of development a lot of change and again a normal year but yeah i walk myself into a year of lovely glorious exams that are going to be difficult i can guarantee you Having done coursework for stuff, that's difficult as it is. And having done mock exams, they're quite difficult. And I know that there'll be some younger viewers and younger audiences um, that will be doing their SATs next year. And there'll be some of my age doing exams and GCSEs. And then there'll be some above, they'll be doing their levels. And to everybody who was going themselves into a year of maybe uncertainty, of deep work, good luck to you. And I hope on the other side of this um, screen, or not other side of this screen, but other side of this is like whoever's watching, like if you're watching on your phone and camera, you are wishing me hope. I hope you are. I hope you're wishing me hope. Hopefully. <laughs> but yeah. All change, all go. But so far, this whole year, like 2017, has been absolutely ace. Like, I'm not going to lie, it has been very good. Um, so, yeah. Um, also, another discussion I need to have is about showbuzz. Like, I know that there's people such as Sotaro in attendance and things like that. Um, I'm uncertain about if I'm going to showbuzz or not. Um, at this current moment, I'm quite uncertain. I might be, I might not be. I haven't asked. Either way, I'm I'm keeping quite a low profile there. I could probably be talking to the other people and telling them who I am, but I'm going to be keeping a low profile. If you recognise my voice, you are more than welcome to come up and say hello. You are more than welcome if everybody, care of a parent, gives consent for you to go over to the group of YouTubers say hello you go for that but only with that permission and only with a guardian a parent yeah so i don't want anybody running off because we're not the the group and the community and the omsi forums etc are not there to like the, the what you got to bear in mind is where are you with now it's a quite nice place what you got to bear in mind is where people that although we may seem friendly and you may be able to relate to us got to remember that we're still people that you've met or you've heard or you've seen online like that you've just got to be careful because the, the, it just comes under all those acts of just basic safety and you know I know for a fact I'm not going to buy I'm not going to start screaming and shouting I'm not going to do all stupid and I know that other people there won't do all silly but you've just got to be careful because although we might not there might be other people there wanting to cause trouble so you just so just as a word of warning there to all central fans just if you want if you recognize my voice over at the OMSI stand you are more than welcome to um, come and say hi but on those circumstances so yeah rant over but yeah if showbiz is anything like it was this year or last year gone um it should be very good it should be very good hopefully i can make my way down and do one of central's infamous vlogs again because i right enjoyed doing that showbiz vlog i really did um quite a few buses there as well and it launched the vlogging it launched the vlogging and things that's quite cool. And I think the vlogs are popular-ish. That are getting a few hundred views. It is quite good. But when I need to find something that you guys really enjoy watching. Like we used to on this channel. Used to get like 
twenty-six thousand views. And I, as much as it's nice to have a small fan base, I'm, we're always wanting to expand. We're always wanting to find other people like us. And to do that, you've got to make videos that catch people and draw people in and make people interested. And I need to find out what those videos are. So if you guys comment below and let me know what videos do you like watching on my channel. Like, it's obvious that there's some that you don't like because some don't even get a hundred views. But there's some that people absolutely love that get thousands and thousands of views. And I need to know which ones you like. Do you, is it specific maps? Is it specific buses? Is it just staying up to date with things? I need to know that. And although, like, graphs and listings can tell me, I need people to tell me as well. The viewers, the people watching. So, that that's that's that covered. Um, there is no sound today because there's now music on Roblox. And I'm presuming on the Buses UK has already played, has already done his YouTube video with music. Um, but I don't make that mistake. I ain't making that mistake. So, yeah, I don't do that. Because, yeah. I should probably put my uniform on. I need to show you guys. Ah, oh, what? Stop. Ah! Oh, I'm typing. Oh, that's why. In heck. Scared then. Um, I'll show you the uniform thing when we pull up at the next bus stop that's in city centre. Or town centre. Speaking of Harrogate, from Sunday onwards, they've launched into new buses on the Harrogate, Weatherby and Leeds runs. Well, not new, but refurbished. Won't call them new. Refurbished mainline vehicles. So, yeah. Sadly, more beaten lost. I never managed to get many of those beatens with Transivog. I don't know why, I just never managed it. I never achieved it. Hold on a second, is that bus going the wrong way into town? Okay, it's facing the wrong way, but seeing as it's not on my route, that is a circular, you know, this is a one way circular. So as long as I don't pass it, I'm fine. So we'll pull up here and I'll show you uniform thing of doodles before we get into town. Now we are on the Have a Good Loop. So when you turn right from here, it, it becomes very realistic. So I'll show you here. Um, take top off. We have a leading driver. Look at that. You've got driver that I don't think makes any difference whatsoever. Look. Nice driving form. A driver form, driver uniform. I'm trying to shorten words that can't be shortened. Connect those wheels are going mental. I love it how I'll treat this like on the and I'll look in the mirrors and then I'll just see a load of nothing. As you all know, in Amzi, I don't ignore traffic lights, but because I call this game fun and not, like, serious, I don't wait at traffic lights. I just don't, because, yeah. I look. I don't, like, just go for it and cause accidents. If I see, if I physically see somebody coming through on a green, I won't go through it. But if it's a clear road, I'll go for it. So now this becomes quite realistic. As you go down this, as in Harrogate, you go down the hill, and on your left at this point will be a Betty's Tea Room that usually is queuing outside. So then you turn right onto this road that I think is both ways, so I treat it like both ways, and just totally mount the curb. 
Central, I haven't, that's the first time I've time mounted the curb, so do it in a video and embarrass yourself. So yeah, and then you turn right, this is another one way road. So that's why we're going in this lane to show that. Or do we need to be back in this first lane? To go into the re very, very, very realistic Harrogate bus station. Oh, I've mounted the curb. No, I haven't. Hold on. I'm, I'm worrying about things that haven't happened. Come on. Come on. Why is there so many buses that have just been crashed? Oh, it's a 25 that's been crashed. Uh, I haven't driven 25. So now we'll pull into, as you guys who have been to Harrogate will know, a very realistic Harrogate bus station and stagecoach condemned like connections is right in the end. I think connections is a good company. All the thing is, is I, I on that debate, on that rebate, I don't mean like the condemned, I mean just like they're putting the karma. I think the problem you've got is that with those two companies, it, they're, they're both really appreciated. And although I do I do have a side to the argument that I wish not to discuss, in my full opinion, I do believe that they just I think they just need to work together. I think if they work together, both of them would end up benefiting the most. But sadly, because one of them won't listen and so forth, I don't know the details. It's sadly what happened, and I think it's a shame, because if they both work together and they stop, like, basically in practical terms, like, name-calling and doing silly things, then maybe they could get along. And I'm not accusing either, but I'm just saying that maybe if they all just got along and just appreciated that each of them have half of the market, and stop trying to bully or stop trying to bully each other off, then maybe they'd get more money in the end and they'd be able to advertise as a better company and a better business. But it's a shame really. It is a real shame. Oh. Didn't want to do that, didn't want to do that. So this is how we got bus station anyway when I finish this. So go down here um, and I'll show you the little box on the end and I'll show you where bus spotters in real life stand um, to photograph. So this is quite a nice realistic information box. Um, I hope to work in here one day in, in Roblox World. Hopefully I can get a job in here. Lloyd, if you're watching, I want a job in that box. I love all the adverts on it. Very realistic. And you're supposed to, when you're doing bus point, you go into the car park in front and then you're going through the car park. And if you want photos of buses, you stand there. Although, because this, because you're small in this game, if I'm wanting photos and I'm doing bus spotting, I stand here. So if like any buses came now, I'd stand there and photograph them or screenshot them, as you call it. <coughs> as you call it. So anyway, thank you guys for watching. I do hope you guys have enjoyed this video. I enjoyed it. Yeah, it was a bit different. Hopefully we can get version 2.8 to you guys in a video as soon as possible. But for now, guys, I will see you later. So thank you guys for watching. Please do like and subscribe if you have questions, suggestions, you need to download this. Stay trust me in the comments. Thanks again for watching, and I do hope to see you in the next video I make. Goodbye for now. Bye.